happening, guys. It is Friday, March 17th. It is 9 a.m., which means that is Papa Bear's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Anyway, I have got to go get my hair done this morning, right now. I actually had to text her and tell her we're gonna be like 15 minutes late because I have to stop at Starbucks. Uh, we were drinking and hanging out last night on first date. If you guys missed that vlog, it's already posted. The night before, we were also out on a first date. If you missed that vlog, it's the one before that. Uh, and so I'm a little hungover, a little low on sleep. Today is Steven's birthday, so we're gonna go do a couple things. And then still tomorrow, there's like a cars and coffee something. I'm not sure, we're gonna do some sort of something. So I guess I gotta get going and we still have another full day ahead of us tomorrow. So I don't know what he's planning to do today, but we still have some more birthday shenanigans to get to. In the meantime, I gotta go. I'll see you guys later. Bye. It's 10 o'clock. My appointment is at 10 o'clock. It's 10.04. The uh, salon's right there. It's Phoenix Salon Suites. And actually, Steven is so good at finding women on the internet. If she's watching this, like, as she, if she knows us on Instagram now. So if she ends up watching this vlog, it's gonna be a little weird. But Steven's really good at, like, finding girls. Why is it weird? Cause she's like, trying to get you a good hairdresser. Yeah, 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 but well, you're a scout. He is a scout online. He can find a pretty girl. He can find a salon. He can find a bar. You name it. He can find well, it online. Well, it's to find the good hairdressers because they're always booked up. Absolutely. All the and good. And if you call a place, they're going to put you in the bunk bitch that right? don't got nobody. Right. So Stephen found a, a beautiful little girl right here in Sarasota. She's a little blonde specialist. She's a cutie. She's got cute friends. She looks like a good time. Last girl that did my hair. I think she kind of hated me. That's why she chopped off four of my... Ooh, I told that bitch a trim. She chopped off four inches of my hair. I think she hated me. So I'm super excited. This girl looks like she just won't sh just vendetta -ly, like chop my hair off. So I'm super excited to get in here. I've got my Starbies. I got a little bite she in my belly. She hasn't been happy about her hair in five years. Uh, yeah, right? You see this shit? Well, when you get it done, <gasps> I have been happy. Right, Do a little go. transition. I'll see you guys in a minute. Put this hat back on and hide this fucking mess of her hair. Also, it's dirty as shit. So I hope she's ready for a client of the day. You doing like... Uh, what's that called? Like barber work right here, but it looks like it's all in the Phoenix salon. The door is not open and we have to text her to come let us in. I don't know what kind of sketch shit that is. Everybody but... has their own room. It's their own business. Oh. Like the, like the lady in Denver that did my hair. So I'm trying to tell you. I They're see. all subcontractors. They own their own salons. So it's little rooms and they rent them out. Cool. This so, would be cool. So hopefully if she fucks your hair up. She's the boss. No, hopefully she's really good. And then like maybe if we build like a friendship or something, she could come to the house and do my fucking hair. Do you know how awesome that would be, dude? All right. Hopefully she about to come get us. And then I get in there. I've been crying about my hair since before Luca was born. But then I was so pregnant that I couldn't just sit in a chair for five hours. And then he was so small that I didn't want to leave him for five hours. So even though I'm crying about it today and I miss him already and I am super sad that I have to be here for like four hours, but I got to get it done. So finally, I think she just texted. She said, you can come on in room 107 to the left. What is this? This place is cute as hell. She said she's in suite 107. So we're going this way. Let's go. All right, I'm all set in. We got the go plan of what's happening and then I guess I'll be here for like the next four hours. Steven's gonna go home, wash the car for tomorrow's shenanigans, and then I guess I'll see you guys in a bit with some fresh new do. I'm super excited. You guys know how long I've been crying about this, so I'll see you guys in a bit. And, and this place is like their own room, so everybody has their own little salon in here. Oh yeah, this works. is super cool. This so is like this your own little private room. Right, this you don't is her. About people bugging you and coming and looking at you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> super cool in here. So I'll give you guys more info if you want it. Let me know. I'll see you guys in a bit. So while I was waiting for her to get her hair done, I went shopping, got her a little purse. See if she'll like it. It's my birthday, I was buying her gifts. I don't know what that's about, but this matches the little baby outfits we're getting. So hopefully she loves it. If not, I guess we'll take it back. I love it. I love it. Let's see it. I love it. Oh, look at that. I love it. I'm in love. What you do you guys think? Some TikToks now. Mm. Feel good. Ready to go out for great. date night you and your birthday. Amazing. I got my tan on, my hair done, fitting back in my clothes. I'm feeling good. Mama's yeah, back. You gotta show it off. Right? Mama's back. <laughs> you have How do we get out of here? This way? That way. Thank you so much. This way? Yep. You love it? I love it. I'm in love. She did really, really good. Oh, I feel so fresh. Yes. Oh, 
shades on. I Wait, where's my, the card? Show the card real quick for me. I got my hoops on. I got my gold shades on. So my nice yeah, highlights. You need your hair done. Good. Book online. That's our little snap thing. I don't know if you guys can like pause the screen. And what's the other side? That's vanilla. And the name? Uh, what was her name again? Bianca. There you go. I knew it was B something. There you go. So well, they can't hear me, I don't think. Uh, well, I got it done. This is her own little thing. So if you snap this, that's it. There's like no business. This isn't just like one big salon. It's like many like micro businesses or whatever. And everybody's running their own little thing in each one of the suites. So it's actually just her. So if you call up there, you're going to get Bianca, text her, and you'll be right here. So yeah, this place is legit. So you went, guys don't even know how excited I am. I went shopping for me. Yeah. I couldn't find anything. Oh, you so bought I got me you something? something. What'd you get? What'd you get? Me? We didn't know if you were gonna love it, hate it. Me? Who's the vlog. Oh, that's right. You said you vlogged. But it, an you said you've needed a purse lately, and it matches an outfit you have. My eyes are closed. That's right, you said you were vlogging today without me. How cute. Aww. What is this? A Basechi? That's cute. Where'd you get you don't this? Remember you have that outfit? I thought this looked like the print of my thing. What is this? This is your hat? That's you. Thank you. You don't like the hat? I like it. This is cool. Is that too big? It's a little bigger than what I was thinking, but it's tight. I'm not a purse girl. This is like literally my only purse, so. Did I win? Yeah, it's cool. I was thinking more like something like all black or something just a little bit more chill because like like I don't really wear wild ass prints. That's you. I like my white chucks. You have that exact print. I know and I've only worn it like twice because it's wild now for you me. Can rock out. I like I like plain, plain, my plain chucks. I like plain. So it's a bit loud, but I like it and it's a good size. And finally I'm actually gonna have a nice purse to carry like my chapstick and stuff like that because I've got like a fanny pack and it doesn't really go with all the outfits. So I always shove my phone in his pockets, my chapstick in his pockets. And now I got a little purse. Look at me. I'm a girl. Got a purse. Let's bounce. Ah! Yeah, we're going to go to uh, Rocco's Tacos now. It opened like earlier last week and we never really got in there. So it's a little daytime thing. It's St. Patrick's Day. We'll go in there, get some shots and then maybe get some guacamole and some tacos and get back to the baby so we'll see you guys in a bit we're headed to get some food i'll see you there i'm so hungry i've just been chilling in here all day and i got a sandwich at starby's but i didn't eat it so i'm starving let's go we are in soda so 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 so, so. <laughs> the fuck was that anyway we're in sarasota and we're at this place called two zero i guess it's like a tinting place you even found it's got good reviews and what's cool is he was like just telling me about the present that he had in the back seat I legit like kind of looked in the back seat, but with the curtains, you really can't see in. Unfortunately, these front ones don't have curtains and you can definitely still see in. So we are going to check about getting this tinted, see how much it is, but they've got good reviews. So let's get in here and check this out. Pretty cool how much cars. do you think it's going to be? I don't know. Back in the day when I got my tint done, it was, it was, it was $89. Now uh, it's going to be a thousand. Right now it's probably going to be like $600. Right, let's let's go, go in here and see how much they're about to go. Break my back and my bank. So what's the damage? Oh, it's not too bad. It's only, whoops, wrong button. There's too many buttons in here. Uh, I think she said for one is like 225 and then like a ceramic or something is like 450-ish and we get all fours in the back. So it's not too bad. It's definitely, I don't know what the ceramic is about, but that's a definite price difference from the last time I put tent on my car was like before I met you, like my little Honda and shit, it was like $89. So it's definitely a little price up, but whatever the 200 one, I don't know what that's about. So you know what the ceramic and the difference between all those things it are? It stops the sunlight from coming in. Oh, that sounds good. So what, are we gonna get the nicer, expensive -er one? Is Probably. that is that the better one? Just cause it's more expensive, is it nah, better? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, so I guess, uh, like you guys know, we're a one, call, one car household. So we have to figure out a day when we're going to get a rental or- Or when we get another car. Another car? Huh? What is that, in years? We're not getting another car. Maybe. Oh God, well. We'll get a rental and we'll be back here. Cause yeah, we're just a one car household. So there'd be nothing. We'd have to just drop it off and like start walking. So we're gonna have to figure it out, but they're not too bad. And I guess we'll make an appointment soon. Now we're gonna go get some tacos. I'm freaking starving. So drive fast, but not too fast. 
Okay, so he said just a second ago, we need a new car. He's like, oh, when we get a second car, I didn't know he was about to stop at a place and look at cars, but we do need to get a car this year for like tax write-offs and stuff. It's gonna be like the clickbait car, put like a logo an on SUV. it. And it's gotta be like SUV because it has to be over like a certain weight limit or something. It has to fit all the girls. Yeah, and we gotta be able to fit more than Steven and I. So uh, a cute little Lambo or whatnot would be super cool, but we're probably looking into like the Yaris. Isn't that how you say it, the Lambo? It's like the SUV type and then it's got the sporty, if you guys know about it, it's legit. So we're gonna walk into the Lamborghini of Sarasota, which is right next to BMW, where we bought the car. So I'm gonna go in here and see what's good. We got one in the showroom for you. You like the brown interior? Nah, you don't do the brown. What if the price was right? This is super cool. So out of all these three, which one would you pick? This is cool. Could talk. you fit in that? Nah, I could. I don't know. It barely comes up to your belly button. <laughs> Why, in four months? Why do we have to wait? Because you, they can't sell them yet. I don't think they're out. Oh, like oh, like our car that they only had the pre-orders that came in or whatever? It's He's a brand new performante. He's going to go grab the keys and we're going to take a peek at it. Like the i7 is really cool, but it's definitely still like a luxury and whatnot. So this is definitely really cool. It'd be cool if we get like flashy color though. We just wrap it. Ooh, duh. What? Are those like cloth? Oh, Steven says we should just buy one that's already made because then we can get it you closer it than now. But it would be so dope to just pre-order and pick everything out like we did the i7. Something like this beautiful blue on the inside, that purple or that green. Oh my god, that would be so cool. That would set it off. Oh. Three hundred. No, the Colin and thing. Four fifty. <laughs> yeah. This is super cool. Wait, we're Very. asking you about, he said how long to build them? You can go have in four months. Oh, somebody's already gonna buy that one, but I guess there might be some other ones around. Also, Steven's first happy birthday text message came from our salesperson. We're right next door to BMW. I wanna go in there and see if she's working today. Let me go in and just say hi to her since, I mean, we're literally right next door. You want to? Yeah, let's go say hi to her. Uh, okay, so we're back in UTC, like always. If you guys don't realize, this place is exactly where we were for the cars and coffee. Like, th I think we like literally parked, like right here. So then Georgie's is on the other side of this, and then Rocco's Tacos is right here on the corner. So we're gonna go in here, grab some guacamole, grab some food for mom, since she watched Luke all day while I got my hair done, and then probably like a drink before we run out. So let's get in here and check out what's going on. You love your hair? How does my hair look in the sunlight? I feel so good. Looks good. It feels so good. So you recommend Bianca? Oh yeah, she was legit and she's a cool girl. So we had a good conversation the whole time too, which is also important, especially sitting, when you're sitting in a chair for four hours. You don't want somebody cutting your hair like that bitch did to me last time. Just like out of anger. So no, she was legit. It was good times. Kill time. That's where you got your nails done one time. Ugh, that place is bank. Or it was bunk, not bank. It sucked. Put some respect on bank's name. I know, right? It's always packed. Ooh, it smells so good. I like a guacamole, like the cilantro, like the cilantro. Mm. Oh, those are cute. At least there's not a line. I'm trying to scope out to see if there's any hot bartenders, see if we're gonna sit at a bar at the table. All right, so it's a 45 minute wait. We are definitely not waiting. I am starving, but Georgie's are right next door. We went here yesterday, the day before, and we might eat here again. It's conveniently spot. Which is weird though, because half their tables are open. I know, right? Maybe and, they can't serve everybody. And then we go to the bar, and this old bitch has got her freaking bag on one of the seats. Luckily, I didn't see it, because I would have told her, Get your damn bag off the seat. I can't stand, I can't stand a girl who puts her bag on a seat at a full up bar. Like girl, your bag costs $100, put it in your lap. So note for next time, if y'all wanna get on my good side, all you ladies, just know, 
people hate when you do that. Don't do it. All right, you wanna see about this play? All right, so we ended up not going to Rocco's or to Georgie's because we've told you before that they always have the weirdest hours. So they like open up for brunch and then they close back down from like three to five. So we couldn't eat there. We ended up right next door. What is this called, Shake Shack? Yeah, we got a, I got a mushroom burger. It's got like cheese in the inside. It's pretty good. Um, and then we got cheese fries, regular fries, burger, burger, and yeah some other like refresher drinks but my burger's pretty good i like this so i used to be vegan i do sometimes still get like vegetarian vegan stuff but i like this one now we're going to the butcher for steaks for my birthday mm. Mm. And since we got the car show early in the morning we're not really gonna do nothing crazy no man yeah right we're gonna go home and rest tonight that sounds like really good i so need sleep i'm gonna eat this food then we're gonna go pick up better food and then i'm going to sleep how was it? This is really good. Delicious? 10 out of 10? Yeah, I've been in the hair salon all day, so I didn't really get to consume my my medicine like I like to. So my appetite is a little low, but it's good. Oh, I should have done that. Look, your little burger bite landed on the top of the trash can. This is the last bite of burger. All right. Okay, we're at the butcher and I'm buying some filet minions. That's my favorite. I really don't eat any other type of steak. Ooh, they got the Kobe. You're just gonna hold him as soon as you get home all night? Yeah. Before I left today, I was like, all right. Mom was watching him for a second. And I was like, all right, I have to snuggle him before we leave. It's gone all day. But Steven sent me snaps, mom sent me snaps. I was in my phone looking at pictures. <laughs> I miss him so much. <laughs> All right, so I'm already ready for bed. It's kind of chilling in bed. I put Puka down. Uh, it is eight o'clock now, so I'm getting ready to pass out. Steven just went to the mailbox though to pick up these little, he ordered these in the mail. He used to wear QG all the time. And I think he like found this on eBay. What'd you pay for this? Buttons. Shut up. This is so cute. And then like the inside, they're little buttons. It's like C-O-O-G-I or whatever. It's, you can see, it. oh, there it goes, C-O-O-G-I. A little Kooji, and then I like this too. This is super cute. But yeah, so we just kind of been chilling around the house. We it took us forever to get home today in traffic, but got my snuggles in. He's got a little bit of a tummy ache, but besides that, uh, we didn't do too much for your birthday. But we kind of did some date nights before, and I think we might go out tomorrow. Are we going out with cousin? I don't know. I don't, we still haven't decided. We might go out with cousin tomorrow. So we will see where the day takes us. We're gonna make a couple of text messages and see if maybe we hang out with someone else tomorrow. Uh, that's still up in the air. So I guess I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm getting ready to go pass out. I'm watching a little movie and I'm gonna get some extra sleep tonight because I was a little hungover today from yesterday or no, from the day before yesterday still. So I'm gonna go catch up on some sleep. I'll see you guys soon. TikToks are being made all week and some collabs are coming so I will see you guys later I'm off to bed